Okay, everybody, this is Big Dude. I finally found a show that I actually wanted to review again, which is kind of cool. Uh, this is a, my uh, review theories and spoilers for Terra Nova. Um, the actual pilot episode was called Genesis for parts one and two, which was also the same name as Heroes first episode ever and you all know that I was crack addicted to heroes back in the day and you can still see some of the old uh, you know reviews still here and uh, heroes is actually on Netflix right now and uh, it, there's it's just great but anyway um, all right here's the main characters Jim Shannon and Elizabeth Shannon the doctor they are married uh, they got three kids when they're only supposed to have two in 2149 okay the little girl Zoe uh, gets in trouble, but they all get in trouble. He, um, Jim, beats up a guard and ends up in six years in jail. Well, anyway, uh, they find uh, that uh, Dr. Shannon is going to get to go with the two kids to uh, Terra Nova, you know, which is caused by a fracture in the space time, a fracture in time that apparently, well, there's some issues with this. Um, but uh, they won't let her take Zoe because, you know, that's illegal, whatever. So basically, yada, 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 he breaks out of jail, she, uh, they put Zoe in a backpack, and that's interesting. Hey, we're in Terra Nova now, it's cool. Um, we got Commander Nathaniel Taylor, you remember him from this little movie called Avatar, probably. Uh, he's been there seven years, he was like the first dude that was sent there. Um, the girl guard, we don't see her say much at all, okay, the girl, but she is going to be important, okay, because the way they look at her face and stuff, she is going to be very important, I'm going to tell you right now. Alright, the probe, this is the thing that they sent back through the thing first to see how far it went, and uh, this is mythology that will be important. Uh, this time fracture, and uh, you know, there's a beacon inside it, and they never found it. Okay, so that's supposed to mean that um, they were dealing with a different time stream. Alright, what if it's not the different time stream, okay? Or what if there's ways to get back to the same time stream? It's going to be important, alright? Um, we got uh, Josh, Maddie, and Zoe. Alright, Josh meets up with this girl, Sky. Uh, who was from the 5th Pilgrimage to Terra Nova. Uh, everybody that we know is on the 10th Pilgrimage. Um, and uh, they, he hooks up with Tasha, Hunter, and Max. They're like the bad kids. They're going off drinking. They're going outside the gates. OTG. They're being all like thuglets and stuff. Um, well, anyway, one of the things we see is like markings by the waterfall. Okay, They are like... Uh, Josh says they are like equations or something. Um, my guess is that it is like a map of the time stream or how to manipulate the time stream or to, uh, you know, get a gate back to uh, 2149 or somewhere else, okay? Uh, get back to the regular time stream somewhere, some other way in some other time, okay? Kind of like a Stargate, um, something going on. Um, because, you know, they're, they were talking later about uh, who controls the past, controls the future, and stuff like that. Alright, there's definitely equations of mathy proportions. Alright, uh, the bad guy is off to try to kill Taylor. Jim's a cop again. Uh, Taylor starts to trust Jim. Maddie has a crush on the Taylor Lautner clone guy. You know, he's, he was kind of like Taylor Lautner, you know it. Um, the bad people... Okay, the bad people in this whole thing are called the Sixers. Okay, they're not from Philadelphia. Ha 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 ha. Okay, um, they don't know why, but they broke out from the colony. Uh, they have different agendas. Um, media, uh, the meteoric iron is very important. All right, whether it's used for the sonic weapons that they have, or uh, just building structures and that sort of thing, or you know, perhaps like eventually getting the you know communications or whatever they're able to communicate with the other people uh somehow whether it's through radio or through uh you know when they have a pilgrimage or whatever i don't exactly know but there's got to be ways that they do it well they can send stuff so um yeah i don't i don't know how they do it but um yeah they they make a trade and stuff the the leader of the sixers is called mira and uh you know that's that's she's like 
badass. It's pretty cool, actually. Um, the Brack Pack gets some moonshine they were drinking. Um, we find out that uh, Taylor's son right, is from the second pilgrimage. And we also find out that he is basically... Um, he's in league with the Sixers. Right, the Sixers uh, control the quarry, so they get all the iron, too. Sorry, I forgot to say that. Um, and he's making these markings and they said basically every time he gets closer to an answer for the real reason for uh terra nova's existence all right every time he he makes an equation he's getting closer and he's showing his dad all right uh, if you control the past you control the f future all right so far the crack is one way uh i'm thinking that uh they're some of them are trying to do a, a both way type of deal you know and uh yeah but anyway i like the sonic weapons it's cool there's dinosaurs that look neat um i think that this is kind of like uh avatar and jurassic park meets lost i think we're gonna find out a lot more other stuff and uh, i'm actually excited about this because i know that they made 13 episodes and they probably won't cancel it until <laughs> at least those 13 are done um yeah. So, anyway, what are your thoughts about this show? If you watched it, what do you what do you think is going to happen? Um, we're going to find out that uh, the doctor's prior love interest is also at this, uh, you know, Terra Nova, and it's going to be Jim's antagonist. But uh, we're gonna we're gonna see a lot of neat stuff. I think you know. Hopefully, this uh, remains written well, and uh, you know, hopefully, some some crazy stuff goes down. All right, that's it for now. Uh, Peace.